up, gentlemen? Did you catch it? A deep V-neck, gentlemen, is something that stylish, attractive guys like you and me do not wear anymore. There are also some other things that we're going to talk about today. There's no better time than right now to go into your wardrobe while you're sitting at home and check it out and look to see if there are some items that need to be excommunicated from your style repertoire. Today, gentlemen, we're giving seven formerly stylish items a death punch to the freaking style throat because I'm going over seven things that attractive guys like you and me don't wear anymore. Number one is the deep V. Now what constitutes a deep V versus a regular V and are V-necks even stylish at all? So V-necks come in a variety of different depths, right? You got some that are like super deep, you've got some that are like medium deep, and this is what I would consider a standard or classic V-neck depth, all right? When you go into a store and you buy a V-neck, this is typically what you're going to find. But the lower you go, the higher the risk of you looking like a Guido. The question is when deciding between a V-neck and a crew neck, Neck, what do you choose, right? Is a crew neck more stylish? I would say that a crew neck is always going to be in style, but there are a few benefits to rocking a V-neck. Number one is it makes your shoulders appear more broad. The V-neck also helps give your face strength and structure. So if you've got a round face or you've got a weak jaw, guys, a V-neck is definitely going to be the one for you. The second thing that attractive guys like you don't wear anymore is preppy polos. Now, polo shirts, I personally feel every single dude needs a few in his world. Wardrobe. But unfortunately, the ones that are super bright, the ones that have like stripes, give the illusion of you being a little bit younger and not exactly as stylish and sexy as you could be. Instead, boom, polo perfection, gentlemen. This is what I'm talking about, all right? This polo is as close to perfection as it gets, all right? It's a solid color. The other thing that I love about this polo, as opposed to most other polos on the market, doesn't have that annoying band of ribbing at the bottom of the sleeves or the collar, right? It's standard fabric. Gentlemen, the other thing that I love about this polo, right? Little bit of subtle detailing. The collar isn't real big, so it's not going to like lay down and get all crazy. Gentlemen, if you want to check out this polo, it comes from today's video sponsor, Public Rec. Below this video, I'm going to link to this polo shirt. It comes in a few different colors. All of them are amazing. The polo shirt looks incredible with jeans, but it also looks amazing with something else Public Rec sells, which is the all day, everyday pants. So these are the all day, everyday pants by Public Rec. I've talked about them before. Guys, if you don't have a pair, now is the time because that discount code down below guys is ridiculous. The reason why you're going to love these all day everyday pants so much guys is because not only are they crazy comfortable, I'm talking like you can work out in these things, you can lounge around the house and not look like a total slob, which is actually the third thing that stylish and attractive dudes like you and I don't do. It is time to ditch the big baggy sweats and get with something a little bit more sexy, a little bit more grown up, a little bit more alpha. Gentlemen, the all day everyday pants are perfect for working around the home. You can also work out in these things. They are so crazy comfortable. They got nuts like ridiculous stretch guys. The fabric is some like space age teched out like uh, I don't even know. All I know is that it's crazy comfortable. I have had these pants for years and they still look as good as the day I got them. They didn't stretch out they didn't fade. The other thing you're going to love about these pants, guys, you can wear them running around town and still look amazing. The thing that you're going to notice about them, guys, they're not big and baggy, right? They taper nicely down to the ankle without being like a jogger. The other thing and reason why I love them, they come in sizes. So you get to pick your waist size along with your inseam. They also look amazing with this fresh ass hoodie, right? What? Exactly. Gentlemen, the pants are crazy versatile. This hoodie also comes from Public Rec, all right? It's got a little bit of a v-neck. It doesn't have strings, so it doesn't get all wacky and crazy. It's got a pocket. It's got a hidden pocket. Guys, if you want to check out the hoodie, the pants, or the polo shirt, or anything the Public Rec sells, guys, now is the time. There's a link down below. There's also a discount code. That code, it doesn't get any better. Public Rec is an incredible company. The quality, the comfort, the style, ridiculous. The fourth thing that attractive guys aren't wearing anymore are stupid hats. What's up, dude? <laughs> exactly, right? Well, that was my cool impression. Gentlemen, here's the deal. I know that there are a lot of dudes out there that are like, dude, Alpha, you're wrong. That's, that's, that's my jam. Dude, I get it, right? Because this used to be my jam too. I used to rock this like all the time in the winter, right? I'd be like, yo, is my hair okay? Am I showing enough? <laughs> you know exactly what I'm talking about, gentlemen. It's time for them to go. And while we're at it, we might as well throw in like <laughs> wearing them, wearing them like this, right? <laughs> 
<laughs> it, 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 yeah. This isn't a look that I'm gonna be rocking, but the reality is that this is how the cool guys are wearing their hats. Unfortunately, I still personally think it looks dumb. Speaking of dumb, the fifth thing that attractive guys like you and I aren't wearing anymore, gentlemen, is time to remove them or make jean shorts out of them are overly destroyed or distressed jeans. Instead of just throwing out those overly distressed or destroyed jeans, guys, make jean shorts out of them, all right? It's a great way to upcycle old clothes that aren't exactly stylish anymore, but in my opinion, the jean shorts are definitely going to be a summer staple for all the attractive dudes. Speaking of shorts, the sixth thing that attractive guys aren't rocking anymore, gentlemen, are big, baggy basketball shorts. In my opinion, basketball shorts are absolutely unattractive, ugly, and should never be worn. Unless you're seven foot six. If you're seven foot six, you can wear basketball shorts because they look normal. Unfortunately, the reality is that most of us are not. And so, as a result, big baggy basketball shorts, whether or not you're working out or just kicking it, end up making you look like you're five foot two. We're gonna throw in, or should I say, out cargo shorts as well. Cargo shorts, gentlemen, they're just not where it's at in terms of looking stylish and sexy. You wanna make sure that the shorts that you're wearing fit you like your jeans, fit you like your slim fit chinos, gentlemen. Not too big through the thigh, nice and slim, also not too long. You wanna make sure that you can see the knee. And last but certainly not least, the seventh thing that attractive guys aren't wearing anymore are overhyped and overpriced crap. Gentlemen, these shoes cost like 600 bucks. You're like, what? Those ugly things? Yeah, you know why? Gucci. Don't. Did I mess up my hair? <laughs> <laughs> all right, so here's the deal. Gentlemen, I know it's hard. I know that in the moment, it's all like, you get excited, right? And I know that it's hard a lot of times to like push down that urge to buy something that you're super excited about or you see on Instagram. But the reality is so much damn money is wasted on items like this that you might buy and you're like, damn, they're the greatest thing ever. Actually, nobody's ever said that about these. <laughs> they're ugly. Everybody agrees to that. But for whatever reason, and I was in the moment. I was in the store. I tried them on. I was like, yo, they're kind of cool. Are they cool? They're, they're Gucci. Gentlemen, who gives a shit? Go timeless. Go classic. Gentlemen, don't waste your money and don't get all like hyped up and all excited about things that are just never going to be worn more than like twice. And that's it, guys. Seven things that attractive guys aren't wearing anymore. Hey, we're wearing the hell out of them. But now it's like, yo, I'm more casual, cool. It's about saving money. It's about being smart, gentlemen. Knowledge and hope Hopefully this video helped you get a little more of that.